Tales of Arise is finally out. I'm only about six hours in myself, but I have been loving the game so far. The combat is great, the music slaps, and the game is just beautiful. But what's not beautiful is the horrible pop-in that constantly happens through the entire game. All kinds of environmental details like rocks, trees, and buildings will just morph all around you right in front of your eyes. It drives me crazy. Take a look at this footage, keep an eye out for just how much all the little rocks, all the little walls just morph and transform, but have no fear. There's a very easy fix for this on PC. It'll completely eliminate this pop-in, and I'm going to show you how to do it. Lucky for us, this game uses Unreal Engine 4, so changing some parameters for a higher draw distance is as simple as finding the right file and making one little change. You don't need to download anything, you don't have to install any extra fixes, and from what I can tell, it has very little performance impact. Now one thing to keep in mind that this won't fix is the way that the NPCs pop in, because that doesn't necessarily tie into making graphical changes, it's gotta be something the game is doing on a deeper level. I haven't found a fix for this yet, I really hope someone does, but even just this change I'm gonna show you today is so transformative, I highly recommend that everyone plays the game this way. Alright, enough chit chat, let me show you how to do it. From your Windows desktop, go to your search bar and type in percent, app data, percent, and click on the folder that shows up. Now go to the top here and click on app data to go back one folder so we can go to this folder. You should see these three options and click local. From there, click Bandai Namco Entertainment, Tales of Arise, Config, Windows No Editor, and then open up Engine. It might not open Engine up in Notepad right away. You may need to set a text editor for this if you haven't done this kind of thing before. In that case, you want to hover over Engine and right click it look for open with, and then from there you can set notepad as your text editor. Once we've got this file open and you can see the text like this, you want to find the text that I've got in the description of this video and simply copy and paste it just like this under what's already there and then save the file. And that's it, you're done. I'm going to show you a bunch of comparison footage and screenshots here to show you just how much of a difference it makes. It is night and day, it looks so much better. Also, keep in mind the point of this is to eliminate all of that pop-in that's right in front of you. There will still be some pop-in, but it'll at least be very far away from you and harder to notice, how it should be and how it is in most games. Now upgrading this draw distance and the shadows especially, I was expecting a pretty big performance hit for this, but on my system with all the benchmarks that I ran, it only dropped about 5 frames a second. Now your mileage may vary, I myself have a 3060 Ti which isn't the strongest card out there right now, but if you find that it drops your performance too much you may want to delete all the files that have to do with shadows, but again it makes such a little difference for me I don't anticipate anyone having to do this. I can't tell you how relieved I am that this is this easy to fix, I played the demo on PS5 and immediately noticed how bad the poppin' was. Seeing it on there, that was the whole reason I got it on PC, so I'm just really happy you can fix it this easily. It's sort of a shame that it's this bad on console, especially on the next-gen systems. You really get the feeling that they aren't taking full advantage of the PS5 or Series X. You saw how simple it was for me. It should be an incredibly easy patch for Bamco to do, so I would love to see an update on the consoles to just get rid of that horrible poppin'. It really is that bad. So I really hope this helps you guys out. If you have any questions, uh, go ask Reddit. I really just can't be bothered. All right, fuck off.